guys, it's Friday. We got some exciting Shadowverse action today. Gonna be trying out the Baldoofy Roost Dragon. We'll see if that's any good. Uh, my birthday is tomorrow. We are turning 29. And I figure so that you guys can wish me. Did you hear that chat? Uh, it is raining really quite badly where I live. So there is a chance that my power goes out. There's like a crazy thunderstorm. I'll stream tomorrow. Probably won't stream for as long. And you know, it might be a little bit earlier. But um, should be a nice, happy day tomorrow, I hope. Imagine having a job. <laughs> The first game I totally forgot, Ruth was in his deck. Yeah, I need to watch the latest episodes. I have not caught up yet. Give me a Peter. Oh, come on, dude. What is it? What are these hands, chat? Oh, this is AS. I guess we just pass. Pretty sure I have to hold this for the Evo. And no Peter in sight. Gonna lose to the Dreamer Skeleton, <laughs> perhaps. We you like to get to choose what class you are? Do you mean in the game? I don't know how that works. I'm sure you can play multiple classes. What are they gonna do? Did you just play another one? Okay, Peter's still the best draw. Okay, that's maybe second best draw. Actually, okay. Okay, I'm gonna hold the zero cost. That way, once I roost, I might as well get a discount on whatever I draw, right? Spent almost 2% of your life playing Shadowers. That's really not a lot if you think about it. You remember how many breads I've eaten? I have not kept count, no. But I can tell you that anytime that I do eat bread, I'm a happy panda. Corpse? That's fine. We can just punch him. I'll gladly punch him. There should be a bread eating counter. Okay, so we go Roost Girl. Get the Roost up in here. I still want to draw the dragon, right? Okay, so anyway, we started drawing cards. Okay, three play point world. And what's behind door number two, chat? Okay, one cost Aether. What about the next door? Okay, a dragon, that's nice. We'll fuse the mammoth, right? Make the trade, go back to 19. And I guess just chill. You like $1 buns at the Chinese bakery? That sounds good. Yeah, it's pretty good terrain. If you ever come to Florida, I got you, dude. Get you some good bread. A uh, nice bike, nerd. <laughs> Well, probably okay, right? Probably gonna be fine. Okay, so... Get rid of the urns, right? Wait, should I play this and just banish his stuff? It doesn't seem bad. Like, deny the card draw, deny his shadows. Let's just do it. I feel like banishing the card draw is good enough. It's doubly good because we have Roost on the board. He gets no shadows out of that. And when I drop all dang, I don't know, I'll do something. <laughs> Have you ever seen that GIF or video where like, <laughs> it's like a, it's a basketball game and there's like the mascot, he's like this little red raptor and he goes up to one of the cheerleaders and he just like takes a bite out of crime and then the announcer's like, devoured. <laughs> Does anyone know what I'm talking about chat? Am I crazy? I think we pumpkin dragon first, just to see where we're going with it. I still need to drop off Doofy. I play another one, I overdraw like crazy. Do I just boom devil? Start getting some damage? I guess. I have to clear that though. And I'd rather keep the boom devil alive. <laughs> he has three Evo, but... I don't know, my Lincoln should be better, right? Read the flavor text for the dragon. I read the text if you pay for it. That's how it works around here. The Evo Pummy Dragon feels spooky. Okay, he's getting more card draw. Another Deathbringer. It's annoying, he's getting death in your value. I don't have a clean answer to this one. Finally get the Baldane though. I mean, I guess we can go for it after Baldane? Yeah, I still don't like urns. At the record show, I still do not like urns. Yeah, I mean, it's doing three damage. Not the worst. You play urns. Well, that was useless. But I can start fusing. So we're just gonna do the, the chunky boom that we'll try. Yeah, I mean, it's not the worst. He gets a clear, but whatever, man. I won't take any face damage, because this at least has ward. Is that the video? He did the bar of the cheerleader? Yes, it's a good video, though. <laughs> Great card. I don't like urns, dude. I really wish it was different. Path technology? Wait, I can just... We could banish that, though. Right? And I have heal. My deck has so much heal. I can just sit here and spam pumpkin dragons, worlds, all the good stuff. Uh, urns is a girl. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, I did deck out once with it. Is he gonna trade it away? Justice was carried Turn out. Back now. I'm okay with that. 
I'm really fine by that. I should banish this though. Not banishing that would just be wrong. So I think we just play. Dude, where's my Natura cards at? Can I get some Natura cards? I think I just play this. We banish his board. Play the Phoenix Girl, just because it's a 2 2. Play a Pumpkin Dragon. All right, Velociraptor, that's what I want to see. We need Velociraptor power plays. The gold Unica. Unica had a nice loaf of bread, you know. <laughs> Seeing Pumpkin Dragon and the world side by side is embarrassing. Hey, come on, that's a rough comparison, man. Can you really make that? <laughs> you can't compare them like that. <laughs> that's just BM. One's a Pumpkin Dragon and one the world. Another path. Well, I mean, I have good face damage. I could just feel, I guess. Now he has no cards. Uh, oh, it's turn 10? Oh, that's crazy, bro. Is there a lethal chat? I don't think I want to attack with the world. I don't think I want to do that, right? Is there a lethal? If this hits the world, we'd have 13. I mean, there's a chance that I get lethal, but do I risk it for the biscuit? We play Boom Devil plus the world. Okay, so the world attacks. Okay, so Baldufi does three. Oh, it's still lethal, right? Because he goes to nine plus five plus four. Adding flames to the fire. You're mean. And we'll just heal so that I, I don't die to the world. To a new world. And we shake his hand. Nice, let see. I guess no matter where the world hit, there was always going to be lethal, right? So it feels good, man. It's, it's not actually a risk. Turns out something. that all the scenarios give me lethal. Right, not bad, chat. 2 0 so far. Don't sleep on it. Two. Okay, best draw is uh, Oracle, maybe? We can T-Rex or that. That's perfectly fine. And I guess we'll fuse the other one. Pick up a play point. Something about him might be the chosen one she's waiting for. That might be just how he looks after eating so many dragons. <laughs> He's 999% the dragon. Okay, Boom Devil, excellent pickup because it lets me fuse. And now we get to fuse for sweet, sweet card draw. Although in hindsight, I could have waited and then done that after the Roost Girl, which seems like it would be cool. Then again, if I draw an Oracle or a Peter right now, it would be pretty good. So I don't necessarily regret that. Would I hold the Aether for next turn? We got, you know, better roost value. Not sure yet. Is it worth it? One extra discount or something. One full play point. I guess I'd rather get the discount, right? So we'll wait. Maybe somebody should play, should pay for his lore. The answer's probably there. Are you saying we could just look at the game and find the truth? Perhaps, sir. But there's no guarantee. Sometimes the lore gives you everything. And sometimes it gives you nothing. Okay, Oracle is nice. Uh, yeah, I should have used Aether because it's not actually turn 5. That's true. We should have used Aether last turn. I was going to have to play the tree, but it's okay. It'll be okay. I, I promise. It's going to be okay, man. Okay, we'll go Roost Girl. Let the land be graced by I'm Let the so land be so-and-so. Play Oracle. And I guess at this point, we are waiting for the Aether for next turn. And we'll see what happens. Some people already know because they already read it. <laughs> Imagine reading lore by yourself. When you can pay me in clown books to read it for you. <laughs> the cards got reduced? Hey man, that's just part of the risk, you know? What's he gonna do? Play a four play point trio? You think that scares me? Maybe a little. Hands of my clown books? <laughs> we didn't normally see normal activity when you get tired of the ladder. Hey, Baldufi's kinda nice. Not particularly bad. Let's draw first though. Oracle is nice. Oracle is very nice. Peter? Peter is insane, right? Wait, how is the interaction chat between Baldane, Evil, and the Discounted Corrosion? It doesn't cost zero, right? It would cost one? I'm pretty sure if I would cost one. I do struggle to too smart chat. Myself. We're too Does smart for this world. I guess we'll clear you. the bane. Okay, how much damage are we doing? No no. Two damage. Comes one by my math. That's what I thought. Shutting down. Okay, we can uh banish his board. We got mammoths. Probably want to just keep chaining Peters and stuff, right? See what else we can pick up. 
Baldane's like a bad raw. Well, maybe raw is a good Baldane. <laughs> it's not like Baldane is bad, right? <laughs> Did I watch the anime? Not yet, sir. I'm still a slacker. If you remind me, remind me, just ping me on Discord at some point. That's not during stream time. How is Roos warded? It's warded incorrectly. So Roos says, when a card is added to a player's hand, its cost drop by half, which is not the effect that it does. What Roos says is, while Roos is on the board, your cards in hand cost half, and they can never cost zero, is what it actually says. Or it actually does, basically. Okay, so we start with Peter, right? Actually, do I start with the world? No, probably Peter, right? Actually, no. Because if I draw Great Trees, Peter's the last thing we want to play, right? I shall give birth to a new so I think world. we go with the world first. Okay, now we go... I guess... No, we go Oracle. Bite one of these nerds. And then I Peter, right? And I guess down. at this point I'm supposed to Evo set Peter. Actually... Is this better? The ramp from Peter doesn't matter anymore. They each just draw one. But I'd rather be more playful and efficient this way, right? It's actually just better. Okay, Baldufi's doing real damage. Like, it's, it's actually doing something by now. And I just don't want to die to shenanigans, so I'm gonna evil in case that might do something. We have whatever Croatian's doing, and then next turn we could do, you know, more damage with it, and maybe combo that with a Boom Devil or two. Is it gonna be 18 though? Probably not. Simple equation against Shadow, no Gremory, no win. He did use his, sh use his shadows, and usually if you use your shadows, you sort of, uh, you know, ignore the Gremory. It bugs me how it's written, yeah. Basically, what is written is not what it actually does. Just, once you realize that, it's not that bad. Couple dogs? I mean, I, I bet those feel like pretty bad draws now. The dogs don't do anything. I mean, they're one once, they're kind of cute. He's got a treat, good evil art. Better Not the worst. Letting their skeleton. Does what is written? No, it does not, sir. It does not do what is written. Okay, takes the trade. The world so he has three on. cards. I'm pretty sh confident that we win. Oh, uh, there's the game today. I'm pretty confident that just, uh, I'm pretty confident we just win now, right? Remember is not activated. It does have ward though. Okay, we have heal, we have card draw, we have dread. Okay, so Corrosion's doing three damage, right? I get it to five. And then we play Boom Devil, Pumpkin Dragon, and that's my turn. Not particularly bad. Should I be fusing into this one for the card draw? Would that be wrong? I mean, decking out is a real possibility, right? That could happen. Pretty sure we're gonna start fusing. Also makes hand space. Which I guess isn't bad. Not like that's bad, right? Okay, so let's go Pumpkin Dragon first. We got 9 cards. Go to 16 life. Some of these are good. Would you guys trust the urns? Never, right? Do I want to play Boom Devil? Maybe it's better if I just hold it for surprise burst, right? Wouldn't it be better if I just wait? Might as well just get the most amount of life that I can this turn. I think that would be better, so let's just do that. We'll just get maximum damage, maximum life gain. Seems about right. Okay, so now Corrosion does a truckload of damage. And then next turn we combo with Boom Devil. And I think it should be enough. If he kills me, then so be it. But I think we'll be okay. Roos does not do what is written, dude. It really, really doesn't. Look, Roos says, when a card is added to a player's hand, it costs drop by half. That is not what it does. Maybe let's run March of Jiggins for 3 play point to draw guaranteed discounted 10 drop. Oh, do you mean for the card draw? That seems pretty bad, sir. If you want to run I card draw, you can play... Uh, Draconic Call. Draconic Call gives you a good card draw, I guess. If you feel like you want to draw earns out of your deck, that's an option. You tried it, it wasn't bad. <laughs> that's pretty funny. Okay, uh, do we have Lethal? We have one Boom Devil. We got an urn that could, I repeat, could go phase. <laughs> okay, so it's doing 8. If urns roll storm, it is lethal. And if it misses, I... Man, does it really come down to this? Does it just come down to me rolling a coin? Because I could just banish most of his board, right? And then we just heal. And surely we win next turn, right? Okay, I think that's the, like, the smart thing to do, right? Okay, so the world. I shall give birth to a new world. I go to 17. The I banish everything he has. On. And then next turn, there's no way that he ever survives. 
Corrosion here, plus Boom Devil next turn. No, no way he ever survives that. I think it's good enough. It gives us that pop-off turn if all else fails. It serves as 4th, 5th, 6th card that gives us game plan. If you're gonna call. It tastes better than it looks. Consistent is behavior, but you have to know about it. Right, you have to know about it because what it does is not what is doing in the card. Well, Trio is a good card. Trio is a great Chatterburst card. But it's not good enough to save him. He gets a, uh, you know, cute amount of damage. If they work correctly, the language hunt is just bad on Roost. That's what I'm saying. I'm not saying that Roost is not working intended. I'm saying it's, it doesn't do what it says it does. That's all I'm saying, dude. Okay, I think I'm gonna start fusing. Getting that early ramp is crucial. Forces that we're up to something good. What if he's doing vehicles, man? Isn't that respectable? Don't you respect the vehicles? The bikes? <laughs> the horse? What is the name of the horse chat? It's something Steve, right? What is the real name, though? Okay, we'll fuse one dragon into the other one. That's just how things are done around here. And then hopefully we get a card draw out of it next turn. That would be ideal. Mechaman was still in the format. World would probably be kind of good. Would probably be kind of good in this deck. Ah, uh, the Dutiful Steed. That's the one. Wait, he's got Great Trees too. You know, these will be gone soon, chat. Well, you guys missed the Great Trees? Did you look fondly upon them once they're gone? Uh, I mean, that's card draw, technically. And like I said, it could combo into more card draw. If I draw an expensive, a big trendless. Or I guess we just play Baldufi. I mean, the spell will be expensive, but just be floating playpoints otherwise. <laughs> Cannot escape the shadow chat. I'm going face man. We need Natura too. <laughs> you know, you mean how like uh, Machinus came back? You think the Natura card should come back too? What about Natura Portal, man? Isn't that the biggest, most tragic archetype? Natura Portal path. It's called World of Blue. It. Two unnerved Damian Boogaloo. <laughs> Okay, uh, card draw is still the best, so any big Chungus is ideal. Any chunky guy. That is a chunky guy, which therefore makes it a pretty good... Okay, so now we draw the Roost Girl, that's ideal, right? Okay, not quite. Well, what the hell do I do now? I guess I let him proc the world. Uh, playing Corrosion seems kind of bad. Maybe I Boom Double? <laughs> uh, it pushes face damage. If I had the Roost Girl, we'd be so in there, chat. So, and I mean so in there. 8 play point King Crush. Dude, I love King Crush. When I started playing Hearthstone, I pulled an animated, or not, yeah, animated, a golden uh, Karn Bloodhoof, I think is his name. And I disenchanted his ass to craft a King Crush. No regrets. I for one will miss the monkey with the, the bikes. I feel like I'm okay taking five damage to the face. I have to be. I have to be okay with that. So let that be our play. Data run again. It's always next time, Dan. I think you still have like uh stage one is still around for a day or two, right? So good luck tomorrow, man. It might be dry, but it's home. Okay, Bargman. It goes face. It won't be long now. Oh, I mean, that's pretty good tempo-wise. I'll look after this town for as long as I Destroying breathe. people in the last two games got destroyed. What deck are you playing? I think it might be hammer time. Dang, that's actually pretty strong because you get to push a lot of damage. Wow. I mean, to be fair, I'm like I'm sitting here passing, right? But Roost Girl's a nice draw. If it wants to give me a life chat, we'll find out soon enough. enough. Okay, so we just first get to life, and now that Roost is online, what are we talking about? Roost counted. I don't answer the Sakuna though. The Sakuna apparently just strikes, so she's gonna get the attack again, and that's pretty spooky. Might be hammer time. <laughs> Playing Warcraft, easy no brain to play. Hey, you gotta come back. Is he gonna flood me? Wait, really? So weak. Be your own master. Uh, what the hell do I do now, chat? I need to get all the card draw out of my hand then. That means that I just, I fuse everything into this, right? And then I just play stats. Oh, that's funny. I don't want to fuse the Boom Devil. I feel like I want the Boom Devil though. But then he gets to fuse it. No, that's bad. I have to fuse everything. We have to fuse everything. <laughs> Except for this guy. We can play that guy. Okay, so I play Peter. And we play T-Rexer. So he gets the Baron Dread, which he can't play. Oh, come on! And then he only has one other card to work with. I have play points, and he's only at eight. Ow! 
We're doing that sick corrosion damage. I guess it's better to play Boom Devil and then fuse the T-Rexer, right? I just gave up five damage there for no reason. Your oh, he drew corrosion. That's super funny. It's actually really super funny. <laughs> uh, what's better at this point? This, right? It's still way better. Okay, give me something good, man. Give me something juicy. It's not bad, I guess. I mean, do I want an Oracle? I think we just want an Evil Face, right? Okay, Corrosion's doing big boy damage now. <laughs> okay, he takes two. My board is insane. <laughs> he has a dragon that he can't play, his own Corrosion, and then one card he top deck. Which is Baldane. Actually, wait. Well, that lets him clear two followers, but here. he'll still be dead. <laughs> I do struggle First time seeing the evil T-Rexer. Yeah, he's Does pretty rare. We still win, though. We rolled the uh, correctly there. <laughs> well, you know what they say, chat. That Shadowverse, man. Why would he fraud there? Because he's forced. What else is he going to do? Execute his own game plan? Well, his game plan wasn't bad. <laughs> He had face damage. <laughs> oh, man. All right, chat. So tomorrow is my birthday. I will stream tomorrow. I'm going to stream one hour before the usual stream time. And you guys can all come and wish me a happy birthday. And I would be a happy panda if you did that. And because my birthday is tomorrow and I am going to stream tomorrow, that means that we are not, I repeat, we are not doing a Monday stream. Because, you know, we work the SBO and I'm, I'm a tired panda bear chat. Sometimes we're just tired. So not going to stream Monday, but should be hype Saturday stream. If you guys like what I do, we stream Monday to Friday at 3 p.m. East. We got a Discord and a YouTube with daily uploads, daily YouTube uploads. You guys should definitely check those out. I hope you guys have a good night. I'll see you guys tomorrow for my birthday. See you guys tomorrow, chat.